Hey everyone, welcome back to Figure Fantasy. So we are here now at Apocalypse War and again Apocalypse Legion. And uh, if you click here, it's actually my highest point scored for this one recently. And uh, here's my lineup. So Zarola, Rimuru, Megan, Ayanis, Sakura, Zephyr. And um, let's do a clear for this one so that you could appreciate um, how formidable the new lineup is. Then after this, we're going to be going over the lineups um, and also the gears that they have. Okay, so again, Zephyr, Sakura, um, Sakura occupying special zone as well as Zarola. You have Megan, you have Ayane, and you have Rimuru here on top. Uh, for additional damage so again this uh, Rimro is uh, I, I think a new addition here and makes a very big difference Ayane as well in the middle because of Frost um, she does also do make a big difference plus Zerola of course for maximum DPS then you have here Sakura for silence then uh, Zephyr on top for your energy addition and your heal so let's uh Try this one out. Okay, so this is the first time I think that I went beyond 300,000 for damage. So, was able to reach 400 for the first time and was happy a bit. Um, the tricky part here is most um if you don't have a yani guys well built that's one and um also for rimuru if you didn't get rimuru um that's also two so the rest i think you have already like for example uh megan most of you guys have built her since the start zarola sakura and zephyr so those two are um if you don't have rimuru um try rin because i think the first version was Rin. I just replaced Rin because I found out that Rimuru was, uh, again, has a lot of damage not only for one target but for multiple targets and also has lifesteal as well built into his kit. Or, uh, sorry, not his kit. I think, yeah, uh, no, um, it's built onto his gear. So, for Ayane, of course, um, She's been out for a while, but I'm um, not sure if you guys have built her. Um, so, one substitute for her, put Megan in the middle, then put Cross Crusos down below to substitute for Megan in her place. Okay, that's it. So, let's take a look at their gear, guys, and let's see how they were built. Okay, so let's start off with... Uh... Zarola, um, so far my Zarola has been watered down already, uh, but uh, she has a ultimate set plus defense, and this is going to be your end time ultimate badge. No, um, no adornment for her as of this moment. For Rimuru, uh, he has lifesteal set for the four piece, then he has defense for the two piece and exclusive badge. And also exclusive adornment. So if you have them, use them. If you don't, there are good alternatives for Rimuru's uh, badge and adornment. Next is Zephyr. So Zephyr, um, if you if you missed some of my videos, I already mentioned that I moved her up to support. Oh no, not support. Sorry, she's still with HP set. Um, the one that I moved up to support was. Erixia for the 4P set. So she's still with all HP set. I still have two more slots for pink. So some of them are already um, reinforced. So again, um, just to continuously improve on your gear. Uh, she has Eternal Eden Badge, which is a big help. And um, her adornment is uh, exclusive for helpers. Periodic healing. Restores 5 energy and reduces the next damage taken by 20%, which really, really helps. So we're done with 3. The other 3 is going to be Ayane here. So Ayane has lifesteal set as well and defense. And this one it improves her accuracy in terms of um, putting out frost as frequent as possible. Then her 
exclusive adornment. Of course, this is what I mean with support set for Erixia, but she's not in the team anyway. So let's move on. Um, Megan here. So Megan has ultimate set as well. And uh, this is actually a heal set for the 2P set. Then she has Eternal Glory badge for her badge. And the last one is going to be Sakura. So Sakura is going to be also be using a support set. Um, again, this is uh, this is actually the way to go with her. She's not a pure healer. Therefore, she's going to need really a support set uh, for her kit. Uh, the other two for the 2P set is going to be your HP. Then we have here the Eternal Eden badge for her. Um, for now, this is temporary. I might change this in the future. But that is it, guys. That is the gear for the team um, for Apocalypse Legion. Okay, so anyway, guys, if you're still here, please do consider subscribing because this helps my channel a lot. Thank you, guys. Stay safe. Take care. This is The Warden, and I'm out here.